This is 1671 North Claremont, the former site of the Dr. Pedro Albizu Campos Puerto Rican High School. Hi, my name is Michelle Morales. I'm the Associate Director of the Alternative Schools Network. I was also, from 1997 to 2002, a teacher here at Albizu Campos as well as a co-principal. As you can see, uh, Albizu Campos no longer stands on this corner. Um, it has been replaced by a condo. Uh, and the entire area has actually been replaced by condos. This area was populated by working class family homes and factories. And all of that came crumbling down as the area became increasingly gentrified. I remember when I first came down Wabansia, that street there in 1997, and I saw the corner of the brick building uh, full of bright and colorful murals and paintings depicting different aspects of the Puerto Rican culture and Puerto Rican um, history. And I fell instantly in awe and in love. I knew then that this is a place I wanted to be at. I knew that that was a place I wanted to work at, where I wanted to make an impact. We moved in 2002 to Humboldt Park, uh, to the corner of Division in California. The rapidness of the gentrification was alarming. And so that informed our decision to move. And in fact, it's been, I think, one of the smartest decisions I've witnessed an organization to do because now we're in the heart of Humboldt Park, we're in the heart of the Puerto Rican community, and we can see and understand the impact that we're making in that community as an institution. We moved here in 2002 as well as in the main building which is located on California and Division Street. These two buildings comprise the high school now. We moved here to the heart of Humboldt Park to not only reclaim our space, but also to make sure that we were building institutions that the community could rely on and use. My time at the high school was precious. Um, it was literally the best six years of my life. It helped me to become a leader. It helped me to become uh, a really strong Puerto Rican woman. Prior to my employment at the high school, I didn't know what it was to be a Puerto Rican, and I honestly didn't know what I was proud of. I learned about my history here. I learned of my culture here. Through that strength, uh, through that learning, through that discipline and that determination, the high school taught me what it was to be a leader, taught me what it meant to stand up for what we believe in, and taught me to be a stronger person for myself, my community, and my children. In September 2012, the Dr. Pedro Albizu Campos Puerto Rican High School celebrated 40 years of existence. 40 years of working in this community, of teaching and educating Puerto Rican youth and their families, 40 years of making an impact. 40 years ago, the high school was founded by various community members, including former political prisoner Carlos Alberto Torres and current political prisoner Oscar Lopez Rivera. On January 26, 2013, we will be celebrating the 40th anniversary with an exciting symposium that will be taking place during the day at Clemente High School and a gala in the evening. The symposium will include various academics from all over the United States coming to speak on the various themes and topics that the high school teaches on a daily basis. And then the gala will be our opportunity to celebrate in a festive manner the achievements of the high school as well as allowing former staff and students to come together. We hope that you can join us. So we're making a call to all former students, current students, teachers, staff members, community partners to come and celebrate with us and as well to help us to raise funds for the high school. Please go on the website of the Dr. Pedro Albizu Campos and purchase your tickets for the symposium and the gala now. Thank you.